Hi everybody, welcome, I'm Kieran Ward. Well, on this video I'm going to make a quick presentation of uh, the mining pool process. Um, I'm very sorry, you know, not to have been able to put some content earlier, but actually I was extremely busy with the code. So, right now we know I have a few minutes, you know, to show you. This will be a very quick presentation, and after we'll make other presentations that will go much more into the details. But, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm trying to give you as much information as I can, as soon as I can. So right now, I have a few minutes, so let's do the necessary. So basically, right here, you are on the mining pool. So this is where you will be able, you know, to mine some uh, HKs. Um, so a quick presentation. So right here, this is like the home page um, of uh, the mining pool. You can download the miners. So there will be two miners. I will show you. Um, you can go on the icon page. So this is a test net. This is a test blockchain on which I've used, you know, to make some tests. And here you can see that you have the HK that you have earned and the HK that you received. So it is automatic. So you receive this uh, very fast. I will make a demonstration. And there, you know, you have uh, the SAT, the global start of uh, the mining pool the statues uh, here you have other stats and also for the transactions everything so how to mine edge cars all right so to mine edge cars you have two options the first miner this one is this and the second miner this one is this one okay so let me make a quick demonstration so for the Microsoft Windows miner when you download it it will arrive um, this way you know in this folder like this so you just have to double click right here and then it opens this box and from this box you just have to go on options right here and then general options then here you have to replace the url with uh, the hkpool.com url and the right port which is h e and then you just have to put your public address right here it is an ethereum address any ethereum address that you have and this is okay so in order to do that you know for me for instance if i go on metamask then i will just uh, yes uh, choose my account you know i copy my address and then i go back on the miner and um well where did there it is okay so I just go back on the miner and I paste my address and I save it and that's it I'm ready to mine then the only thing I need to do is to click here start mining all right and then it is going to start to mine and I will be able to see it right here you know so the mining pool is going to detect my address if we go back here we can uh, see the address so it finishes with f7 e2 all right so this is your address we can remind it and if i go on the mining pool at one point yes so right here we can see it already you know f7 e2 you know so this is my my ethereum address that i put and it will start to to mine some edge cars all right as you can see I've already earned 11 HKs and then, you know, it is not on my wallet yet. And if I want to see what is on my wallet, when we will launch, I will provide um, the blockchain address of the HK smart contract. And once we have this, we will be able to add it on MetaMask. So if I go on MetaMask, and then I um, go on import tokens but here I just have to paste you know the right address so we don't have it yet because we have not launched but as soon as we launch everybody will have the address and you will just have to paste the address right here and then add the token and then you can see your balance all right on MetaMask so as an ethereum fork you will be able to send your edge cards and everything the same way you know you do with other uh, tokens so right here you know i have now my edge cards 
And if I go back on the mining pool, okay, as you can see, I'm mining HKs and now I have 45 on my account. So if I go back, it was A7, it was A7, yes, so, okay. So as you can see, I have HKs on my account. So it was F7, E2. So if I go back on uh, my MetaMask, right here the amount should be you know updated to this so right here you see so i have my articles so metamask sometimes you know it takes uh, a little bit longer to update but um, everything is uh, is great so here i have my articles i can basically make some transactions and everything and if i go on uh scan scan it will be the um, etherscan of HK project, you know. So if I copy my address right here, I go on uh, etherscan, and then I, I paste my my address. So I can see my balance of HK right here. Okay, and if I go on etherscan, you know it should be updated because I'm mining very fast right now because it's a testnet but uh, as you can see I have my HKs right here so as HKs you know I can make transactions if I want I can send the HKs let me do that let me send some HKs uh, to any address this one for instance so I'm going to send like 38 HKs alright yeah so if you want to send HKs, you will have this problem, right? Because I don't have uh, EGAS. So EGAS, it is the equivalent of Ethereum on the network. So if I want to be able you know, to send some HKs before, I need to have some EGAS. So let me take an account where I already made some tests for that. So I'm going to send some EGAS to the address. All right, so this was the address of the smart contract. Yeah, this is not a good address. It was the address of the smart contract. So, no, it is a good address, man. <laughs> All right, I don't, I don't know if I will honestly have the time to remove this from the video, but I hope, <laughs> yeah, guys, it's not too buzzing. So, well, I want to send some egas, right? So from this address, I'm going to send to the address that is mining HKs right now. So I'm going to send like just, I don't know, 10 EGAS and then click on next and then click on confirm. All right, so the EGAS is on its way. The EGAS is on its way. We are going just to wait for that. This account right here receives the 10 EGAS it wants this account as received the 10 egas we will be able to send some hcas from this address okay so it was received let's check it i'm going to actualize hcas scan all right perfectly the 10 egas arrived as you can see right here this is perfect so now i'm going to be able to send some hcas from this address right here so let's do that Let's uh, send some HKs. All right, I just have to find my account. It was this one. So this is the account that is mining HKs. And if we go out right here, the amount, you know, it is already updated. All right, so right now I'm mining alone on the test net. So this is why it is mining so fast. But uh, remember that it will be like 35 HKs every 10 minutes and it will take almost like 10 years before we reach the 21 million HKs. So yeah, just uh, to have this in mind. So I'm going to choose any account like this one. And now you see, I'm able to send HKs. So I'm going to send, let's say uh, like 60, 60 HKs. Then I'm going to click on next and confirm. Okay, so the HK is on its way, it is waiting. And once it will be confirmed, I will be able to see it on HKScan. All right, perfect. You know, it has been confirmed. Uh, now it's uh, it's done. So if I actualize, 
Okay, so there is a smart, a slight delay, you know, between the time the transaction is done on the blockchain and that it can, you know, as a time, you know, to take it into account. So when you make transactions, sometimes you have to wait. All right, perfect. As you can see, now it's here. Um, right now, I'm just finishing HK scan. So right here, you see the amount is not the good one because I'm uh, having, um, I'm working actually as we speak on this one. But um, I mean, everything is operational. You know, everything is great, um, and we are ready. You know, we are ready for the launch. And right here, this is the blocks that you can see right here. So yeah, so that was it for the um world process you know of mining and everything so then when you are mining uh, right here i was mining with this one i think yes yeah, so you can see so this is what you earn and right away you know it is automatic you receive almost immediately you know everything into your account and then as you can see you are able to use metamask or any service to to send hcas you know so as you might have understand you know like on hcar uh, the currency that is rewarding the miners and everything is um, this one, you know, it is EGAS, you know, it is the equivalent of Ethereum, Ether on uh, the HK blockchain. And the HK uh, cryptocurrency is actually ETI, it is the one that uh, is inside the smart contract of HK. So uh, this is the main, you know, process. Then the second miner it is this one for linux it also can work for um windows but if you want to make it work from windows you might have to make some additional install installs if you want to use this one what you have to do yes excuse so when you launch it this is what it does you know it is like an in a command line in, in a console and it mines uh etc this way but before you do that I forgot to show you so you just have to make this um, so you have to identify this file uh, I might rename the files before we launch but you have to identify this file zero xbtc pool you know then you make a right click and you click on um, modify modify the file okay then right here you just have to put HK pool this way with the right port and then the address of the smart contract when we will have it but it's not even important you know because it is a mining pool and the most important is your public address it is not a private key all right it is your public address uh ethereum public address any kind of ethereum address you put it here and then you will be able to mine edge cards. then you save the file you close it and then you launch it as admin all right you launch the file as admin and then it will start to mine edcast right away with the address that you have provided all right so how to get some egas well we have seen that when you want to interact with the edge card blockchain you need to have some egas to make transactions so the first option you have is to mine egas the second option is to receive it so basically i will make sure that when you um, mine some edgecars on the edgecar mining pool that you receive some egas you know i will make sure that we send you some egas on your ethereum address you know so if you want to mine edgecars uh it's very simple but you have to have a full node and i will make some tutorials on how to run a full node of the edgecar blockchain but basically right here i have a full node on uh, a test blockchain and on um, this terminal i've opened you know a console that will enable me to interact with my full node so what i will do you know it's very simple i will first of all set the account that is going to receive what we mine on the full node so i'm going to copy this address right here all right and then i'm going to be back on my full node all right right here let me show you all right so now i'm going to tap miner dot set etherbase all right i'm going to yeah show you this way my little set etherbase then i'm going to open this i'm going to paste my address and i'm going to close it all right 
So this is going to set the account that we see us, what we mine. So now it is done. As you can see, it um, sends true right here. And now I'm just going to type miner.start. And before I start, I want to show you on my uh, MetaMask that basically on this account, I have 9.99 uh, EGAS, as you can see right here. So now I'm going to start to basically uh, mine and we will see that this will increase on my MetaMask, right? So let's do it. Let's do as necessary. <laughs> All right. So right here. So now mine the start. Okay. And I press enter. All right. So now it is mining. It is returning null, which is counterintuitive, but the command uh, worked and now uh, it is going to start to mine some meticals. All right. Again, I'm going to, to be back with much more content and which uh, with much more details, but it was just, you know, to give you some idea and some, you know, overview about the process so that you can prepare and know exactly how it will be done. I hope uh, you liked it. I will be back to the code right now <laughs> to to be able, you know, to to launch uh, on the date and to to be up to what we said. So March first. Uh, I hope everybody will be ready and that we will start a great adventure for HK and that we will be able, the most important, to help people and to cure people with uh, this new incentive that we will give to the world to make open source medical research without intellectual property. So I hope everybody liked it and see you on March 1st.